Hello and welcome to Mr. Thompson's math, math Tutorials. Today we're going to be using double number lines to solve ratio problems. So let's look at a problem. Now in the past we've used tables, but we're going to use double number lines because sometimes they're just frankly more efficient. So let's look at our problem here. A cake requires two cups of milk for every six cups of flour. How many cups of milk, milk are required for 18 cups of flour? So to solve this problem, I'm going to create a number line. So here's sort of a standard number line down here. And normally I would just draw this out um, quickly on a piece of paper. I wouldn't use a ruler. But since I have a computer here, I'll just um, use this one right here. Now, my next step is to actually put some quantities. So my ratio in the question is two cups of milk for every six cups of flour. I'm going to represent that down here on my double number line. I'm going to represent the two up here, so that's my two cups of milk, and here's my six cups of flour. And then I'm just going to continue on adding to my number line. So because these things are varying proportionally, if I add two more cups of, of milk, I need six more cups of flour. So two plus two is four, and six plus six is 12. So that's how I'm getting these numbers here, but they're varying proportionally. In other words, every time I skip a line on this number line, I'm gonna add two on the top and six on the bottom. So here's an example of that. And as you can see, I've actually solved my problem right here. It's gonna require six cups of milk for 18 cups of flour. But I could continue this on as much as I wanted. So eight cups of milk is going to require 24 cups of flour. And then even more, I could continue this even more as we go. So let's have a look at this problem here. It says an apple pie requires two cups of sugar for every three cups of apples. How many cups of sugar would be required for 15 cups of apples? So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be writing on my double number line. So here we go. I'm just getting my pen ready. Okay. So um, I'm going to be writing on my double number line. So this represents my two cups of sugar and this represents my three cups of apples. Now these are varying proportionally. So on the top, I'm going to be adding two every time. So that's going to be four cups of sugar, six cups of apples. It varies proportionally as we go. So I'm adding three here every time. And up here, I'm adding two every time. Okay, so here we go. We're getting six here and nine here and then nine here. Sorry, eight here and 12 here. We would get 10 here, 15 here. And we can see that's the answer to our problem. We were waiting for this to become a 15. So that would tell me that the number of cups of sugar required for 15 cups of apples would be 10 cups of sugar. Thank you for watching.